game of high stakes, where every decision is a gamble, and every move can be your last. ladies and gentlemen, and uh, we've got uh, a player who's very good and has also been very lucky the last uh, couple of times. Let's welcome back A.J. Richards here for his third day. Welcome back to High Rollers, A.J. Thank you for having me, Mark. All right, and A.J., even without a bonus round win last time, you still crossed into the six-figure territory anyway. You're at 101,504, excuse me. Do you think you can improve on that total? I certainly hope so. All right. Well, you're up against a pretty good opponent here, and uh, his name is Michael Bombardier. Hello, Michael. How you doing, Mark? I'm doing fine. Uh, Co-host of two different podcasts, it says here, Game Show Speak and uh, as well as a wrestling one. Yeah, but the same one, but the same one, Dante Pittman, and also uh, ran a rave podcast as well. Oh, so three podcasts. Oh, very nice. Yeah, and, three podcasts uh, in a week. All right. And also, well, big, just uh, say... and also a big New York Yankees fan when it comes to baseball. And as of the day we're actually going to be airing this, the Blue Jays are playing the Yankees in a three-game series this weekend. So best of luck to you in that one there, Michael. Yeah. Thanks so much. And let me just say, hey, I host this at another server. It's, it's, it's such weird being on the other side of the, of the dice. I know, and if I recall, one episode you hosted had me playing against Frankie Sartori, and that was where the whole Lassie bit started. <laughs> well, anyways, let's try to get that out of our system and focus on the match here, gentlemen. <laughs> All let's right, do it. We're starting off in game number one with a gas grill, and we're adding his and her snowboards. Don't know what you would do with that during the spring, but we're also putting a Toyota Yaris in there. Call is worth 24947 Call number two has a steam shower, a pair of blackberries, plus a year of service. Total for that column is 8478 And finally, for call number three, Honda Civic LX and a treadmill. That call worth 19828 Board total were 53,253. And here's how the numbers stack up for game number one. <laughs> Column three is the hot one this time. And a uh, pretty good amount there. Nearly $20,000 worth of prizes. All right. Hands on buzzers, players. Who is depicted on the U.S. $100 bill? And that is Michael. Benjamin Franklin. It is indeed Mr. Ben Franklin himself. Well done. All right, Michael, all the rolls are good, so I'll go ahead and roll away. Oh, all righty. Let's roll them. And right away, you start off with a double to six. I will start with the six by itself, please. All right, six on its own. You're off to a good start here, and here's the next question. True or false, the Lego Group was founded in 1932. AJ. False. That is actually true. Wow. I thought you were right. Yeah, no, 1932 was when it was founded. So, Michael, go ahead and roll it again. All righty, come on. <laughs> good. Roll them. Well, you have a seven. Okay. Yeah, I will actually clear the seven out. All right. Very well. And here's the next question. What is the name of Poland in Polish? Poland in Polish. Um. No. Not nope. stabbing that either. All right. Well. Uh, one of our uh, MVG, well, maybe, okay, Polska. Polska is what we needed. Polska, yeah. Pol All right. 
Which restaurant's mascot is a clown? And let's see, that is Michael. McDonald's. Right. And uh, the, thankfully, the clown is not named Lassie. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, it's Ronald, Ronald McDonald. Ronald Michael. It's Ronald McDonald. Bonus points. Rolling. <laughs> Three. You know what? Well, let's. I will clear the third column. All right. All right. So we have six and ten as the bad numbers. And Michael, you of course know that you only get those prizes if you win this round. What color is the X in FedEx Ground? Repeat. What color is the X in FedEx Ground? Okay, AJ. Orange. Not a bad guess, but not what I'm looking for. It is Kermit the Frog's color, green. Green. <laughs> All right, Michael, uh, roll or pass? Six or ten are only bad. Yeah, six and ten are bad rolls. Two is basically a free roll here. Yeah. Odds are in my favor. I'll roll. All right. Odds are in my favor. Come on. Give me a good one. You've got a seven, and I believe the only way I can give that to you is three, three and four. Three. Yep. There we go. So now we only have five, eight, and nine as <clears> safe <throat> numbers. As I wait for AJ to get back into the room. There we go. All right. True or false question coming up. And this is a bit of a long one, so pay attention. True or false. Dehydrogen monoxide was banned due to health risks after being discovered in 1983 inside swimming pools and drinking water. Michael. False. That is indeed false. All right. I will pass the dice. Pass it to AJ. All right. So, uh, but, uh, all right. Let's roll. No, the four is no good. Michael wins game number one. All right. And Michael, just like that, you've got close to 20 grand in your bank already. So regardless of whether or not you win this match, that is... Uh, the least you're going to be taking home, but I'm sure you'd like more stuff. And uh, we'll see. Hey, of course. <laughs> and we'll see if we can give you more stuff. Call number one: gas grill, the snowboards, the Toyota Yaris, and free home theater seats plus a 46-inch LED LCD HD TV. Thirty-four thousand thirty-seven dollars for that. Call number two: steam shower, blackberries, your service, and a dining group. And call number three: outdoor kitchen island. Total board value, 57837 Let's load in the numbers for game number two. Okay, hot call this time is call number one. And, oh, actually, we've got a second hot call. It's call number Whoa! two. Wow. So those two columns alone, players, could get you over $48,000 worth of goodies. All right, here is your question. The likeness of which president is featured on the rare $2 bill of U.S. currency? Michael. Thomas Jefferson. Yes, Thomas Jefferson is correct. Roll or pass? I'll roll it. All right, gonna roll. All righty, come on, roll him. Five. Five by itself. All right, the five on its own. What is sinophobia? I think I'm pronouncing that right. What is sinophobia the fear of? My God, that was loud there outside my window. Uh, anyways, uh, that is time. Sinophobia is a fear of dogs. All right, true or false? You, lastly. <laughs> Disregarding that, 
True or false, <laughs> Vietnam's national flag is a red star in front of a yellow background. Repeat. All right. True or false, Vietnam's national flag is a red star in front of a yellow background. Michael. False. That is false. All right, Michael, the rolls are still good. Let's roll them. Ten. I will clear the one, two, three, four. Okay. Well, you got yourself one of the two hot columns, so well done on that one. The flag of the European Union has how many stars on it? Time, 12 stars. Oh. And faith, and to save your ears, I'm not going to do that pinball jig that's associated with 12. I'll just move on to the next question. True or false, a passo dobe is a type of Italian pasta sauce. AJ. False. It is false. Yes. Yeah. All right, six, seven, eight, and nine are your good numbers, AJ. All right. Um, let me let me see this. Uh, you know what? I will pass. And pass to Michael. All right. All right. First time I'm in the scenario. Okay. Come on, anything to keep me in. Six, seven, eight, or nine. Come on, give it to me. You have a nine, and that's going to give you column number one. I will clear. The, I will clear the first column. Yeah, and that's the only thing you could have done anyway. All right. When one is envious, they are said to be what color? AJ. Green. Yep. Green with Green envy. With yeah. Envy. Green uh -huh. with envy. Roll or pass. I got pass. All right. I can do this. Come on, give me a six, seven, or eight. Come on. Seven. There you go. All right, only two numbers to go. Who is the author of Jurassic Park? Again, who is the uh, author of Jurassic Park? I didn't even know Jurassic Park was a book. Yeah, I'm not touching that. Time. Yeah, when you think of Jurassic Park, you kind of more think of the film Jurassic Park. The book yeah. was written by Michael Crichton. Oh. All right. What item is a werewolf most afraid of? AJ. Silver Bane. Uh, yep. You, that is right. Very good. All right. I gotta pass it to Michael. Six or eight, please. Six or eight. You got the six? Come on! Okay, Michael, if you get control of the dice again and you end up with that eight, you're gonna win the match and become the new champion. What is the world's most expensive spice according to weight? AJ. I believe that is um, saffron. It is saffron. Oh, gee. I got past to Michael. All right, but come on. Right, he's been very lucky with these rolls, and if he gets lucky again, come he'll on. become the new interim champion. Come on, eight. Come on, eight. No, undershot it by oh. one, and AJ is still alive in this match. All right, well, EJ, you're on the board with $1,000, and we have a tiebreaker round coming up between the two of you. All right, call number one. No. Gas grill, snowboards, the car, HGTV, and a cruise to Alaska. Whoa. And that Whoa. Call was worth 55437 In column two, a steam shower, a pair of blackberries plus a year of service, a dining room group, the wood burning stove, 16,305 for that call. And finally, call them free outdoor kitchen island 
and a luggage set. Total board value now, 83,782. Here's how the numbers look up. No hot column. Aw, sad face. All right. Are you know. Anyway, true or false, the U.S. emergency hotline is 911 because of the September 11th terrorist attacks. AJ. Uh, I believe that's false. It is false. All right. Let's roll them. All right. Oh, he's getting mad now. Uh, I think AJ's got the fire in his eyes here. Seven. All right. Seven by itself. All right. Seven's gone. And off we go to the next question. What does the G mean in G-Man? AJ again. Oh, shoot. Um, geometric. Government. Ah, government. All right, Michael. All righty, come on. Five. Five by itself. All right, the five is gone. True or false, the sum of all the numbers on a roulette wheel is 666. Michael. Would that be false? That is actually true. What? Yeah. I thought with the double zeros. With... Yeah, that's actually a true statement. AJ, roll it. All right. All the numbers still good? Yep. Let's roll. Five. All right. Four and one. Good play. All right. The four and the, the seven are now bad numbers. True or false, there are 86,400 seconds in a day. Michael. <laughs> that is true. Odds are in my favor, so we're rolling. All right. Odds are in my favor. Come on. No four or seven. Nine. You got the nine. I'll take the 6-3. Okay, that'll give you call number one. Okay. Well, uh, Michael, you're in pretty good shape here, but of course this game is not over yet. What is a Dakimakura? What? What? What is a Dakimakura? I have no idea. Are you allowed to spell words? Uh, well, I can spell it out for you if you want. D A K I M A K U R A. I have no idea. I have no idea. All right. Yeah. This this sounds like a Japanese word. I'll probably have to check on that off air. But anyways, it is called a body pillow. Oh. Oh. All right. So now we know. A true or false, an eggplant is a vegetable. Michael. True. That is false, actually. What? AJ. I always assume eggplant was a vegetable. Um... See what my bad numbers. Right. Uh, you know what? I'll pass them to Michael. And I right. think that may have cost me. Three, four, five, six, and seven are the bad numbers, by Come the way. Come on. Give me a double. Give me a double. You've got an eight. It's not a double, but it works. Clear out the third column, please. Okay, over $67,000 currently in your possession, Michael. I would love to see you take all of that home. Come on. All right, <laughs> next question. What is the unit of currency in Laos? Michael? In Laos? Yeah, in Laos. I'll find it. Euro. Kip. And 
just for the record, that is actually a currency I have never heard of. Uh, and uh, second of all, Mark, I don't mean to interrupt you, but it's pronounced Laos. Oh, Laos. Okay. Well, in any event, though, AJ, the option is yours. Let's see. Um, I'm going to have to pass it to Michael. All right. Well, I, I need an 11. I need the 11. It's a 5. AJ retains. Game, and that cost me the game. Dang it. Okay, well. At least I'm going on with the car. Yeah, <laughs> you, you do at least take home over almost 20 grand worth of prizes, Michael. You should definitely be feeling happy about that. Yeah. All right, well, AJ, uh, no prizes for you in this match, but you do have $2,000 in cash. So that's going to bring you up to 103,504. And maybe the third time will be the charm for you here in the big numbers. I hope so. All right. All right, AJ. Uh... You're 0 for 2 in the big numbers. Let's see if you can make it 1 for 3. Roll the dice when you're ready. Oh. And you're starting off with an 8. 8 by itself. Alright. And go again. Roll. 7. 7 by itself. Alright. Let's roll. Double, that's an eight. Hmm. Four, three, and one. All right. Well, you went from two grand to five grand just like that. Go again. Roll. All right, and I'm going to need that marker because uh, we can't use a ten. All right. Let's roll. Seven, and there's only one way you can do it. Five and two. And, oh no. Yeah, there it is. Uh, we might get to start having a count for the number of times the six and nine get left on the board. Go, AJ. Roll them. Well, we're getting rid of one half of that at the very least. Okay, AJ. You need a nine for a hundred thousand dollars. Alright. Roll them. No, it's a free. I am sorry. Alright, well, another eight thousand dollars uh from this match. So let's see, that's ten thousand dollars uh that you have uh for this day. And let's see, AJ, your three-day total, $111,504. So, uh, a bit of a smaller win compared to your first two matches, but still a pretty nice three-day total overall as it is. Fine with me, Mark. All right. Alright, well, AJ, so far so good. You've played three matches and you have three wins. All you gotta do is win two more times and, of course, you will become our first retired champion of the season and you'll also take home a brand new car. He, AJ continues to drive for five in our next edition of High Rollers. We'll see you then.